high voltage battery removal procedure. From in front of the front seat, fold the carpet. Remove the screws on both sides. From in front of the rear seat, fold the carpet. Remove the screws on both sides. Put the car into tow mode. Perform high voltage battery disconnecting. Locate the car on two post lift by pushing it. Lift the car a bit to ensure that lifting points are located correctly. Open frunk and remove the bottom lid. Remove two screws holding the tire repair kit. Remove the kit. Remove two screws holding the front claw. Remove two screws located in back of the frunk. Remove the frunk. Remove the battery tray. Remove the 12 volt battery positive terminal wiring. Remove BMS sensor connector from negative terminal. Release the battery strap. Remove the 12 volt battery tray front cover. Remove the 12 volt battery. Unclip the wiring harness attached to the 12 volts battery tray. Remove the 12 volts battery rear tray. Unscrew bolts holding 12 volt battery tray.
Remove the tray. Release the connector's catch. Loosen the wiring harness and move it to the side. Release the connector attached to the high voltage cable holder. Unplug the connector. Remove the screw for the AC charging supply. Loosen the wiring harness and move to the side. Remove the two screws. Release the catches for the front DC connector. Remove the cable cover. Loosen the screw for the connector. Loosen the connector and harness and move it to the side. Install the special tool 9513166. Connect the end of the string of the tool to below the grill of the car. Ensure that lifting arms are correctly installed and it will not interfere when lowering down the high voltage battery. Lift the car in a working height. Remove all the plastic covers below the car to expose the battery box. Remove the reinforcement brackets on both sides. Release the BECM connector catch. Remove the cable harness clips. Loosen the wire harness and move it to the side. Charging lid removal. Note the clips located on the charging lid. Carefully install the wedge tool between charging port and seal. Lift up the seal. Using finger, release clip located in lower right corner of the lid and push lid outwards. Using finger, release clip located in the upper right corner of the lid and push it outwards. Hold the lid and pull it outwards and down. Take the lid out of the mounting place. Unplug the connector for the charging cable unlock button. 
Remove the lid. Remove the rear left wheel. Remove the rear left inner wheel arch. Remove the screws holding the AC and DC charging cables. Disconnect the connector. Remove the screws for the EVI inlet. Release the catches. Fold the harness aside. Remove the screw holding the leveling sensor bracket. Put the sensor aside. Remove the screws for the longitudinal stay to the wheel spindle. Remove the screws for the brackets on both sides. Position the cables hanging down. Release the clip holding the BECM cable. Remove four screws located in the middle of the battery box. Remove the screw. Loosen the wiring harness or move it to the side. Remove the cooling connectors to the front of the battery box. Be prepared to collect escaping fluid. Undo the hoses from the connectors. Use the lifting table 9997775. Position the lifting table under the battery box.
release the screws holding the battery box rear brackets to the car body. Remove the screws holding the battery box to the rear brackets. Remove the screws from the front edge of the battery box. Lower the battery box 180 millimeters or approximately seven inches. Make sure that the wiring harness does not catch. Remove the screw for the cable holder. Release the connector's primary and secondary lock. Disconnect the connector. Loosen the wiring harness or move it to the side. Lower the battery box. Make sure that the wiring harness does not catch. Remove the special tool for the front DC connector. The battery is now removed. 